We present to you our project C Square S Crowd Control System. Three. C Square S Crowd Control System. Crowd control in crowd control is a very difficult task, especially in places like India where the population is very large. So our model is to create is to create a very efficient crowd control system. The main idea is that. To, or to use technology to automate the gate and move the passengers around the complex for easy crowd controlling. 3. Khatur Shah, a temple in Rajasthan, faced one of the biggest temple stampedes in Indian history. It killed three people and injured many. Now imagine in the past five years, India has faced 30 such incidents just because of a poor crowd control system. Thus, we came up with C, C square S, crowd control system. This will help us predict equal timings for each person, thus reducing our efforts and will ensure that no future stampedes occur. In our system, in each round, the entry gate opens to allow a certain set of people to enter the controlled complex. They step on the conveyor which takes them to the central place. The conveyor stops for 10 seconds so that the people can carry out the desired activity. Then the conveyor moves on and the conveyor stops and the exit gate opens for 3 seconds so that the people can safely exit the complex. There are five main components in our system. A pair of IR sensors, two servo motors, a node MCU and a relay module. The way uh, the gates are controlled by two servo motors which can turn 180 degrees. These are programmed to open and close the gates by rotating at different angles. Then comes the buck converter. Since our node MCU needs just five volts, but the adapter provides 12, we use a buck converter to convert those 12 volts into 5 volts and later this power supply is sent to the MC, uh, node MCU. To stop the conveyor at the central place and at the exit, we use a pair of IR sensors. The way these sensors work is, they send bursts of IR light through the transmitter and if there is an object in front of them, the rays will get deflected and uh, they will be absorbed by the photodiode and if that's the case we can perform actions like opening or closing a gate then comes the servo uh, then comes the conveyor belt this is controlled through a 12 volt 30 rpm stepper motor which will stop and move the conveyor belt to transform people the relay module in our project acts like an internal switch. The relay module consists of two points. NC stands for normally closed and NO stands for normally open. And to switch between NC and NO there is a switch called the common switch. The node MCU. Node MCU is the brain of our project. It is a version of the original Arduino microcontroller. But we have used Node MC in our Node MCU in our project because it is cost efficient and in the future course of action, if we ever need a Wi-Fi module, we need not buy an external Wi-Fi module. 
because node mc has one built in this will automate existing systems which are used to control crowd and will save the money which would have been used to control all the crowd manually having the system will also ensure that everyone get equal time slots and no one gets unfair ones this will also ensure that no future temple stampedes occur